Welcome back to more Pokemon Insurgents! Looks like you've been snagged. And in the last episode, we realized that Cubone could get a Mega Evolution, so I had to run back and go get one. It, it was imperative that I did that. I don't, I don't care what way south, or north, or east, or west that you look. I had to do that. In this episode... I don't know. We're, we're gonna explore. I have an itch. Ah! And not a scratch. Dude, I have to itch my forehead. Did you did you know that itching and scratching are two different things? Most people don't know that for some reason. I absolutely that. Mm, I don't know how people confuse that. Honestly, it's it's like one of those things that made me go like, what? What? No. Whenever people see me, they expect to be mean, and ferocious. But I'm a nice guy. You shouldn't judge someone by the looks. Yeah, it's true facts of life, my friend. You, you really should. <laughs> You're pretty useless. Yeah, really. It is useless, honestly. This one looks like a freaking steering wheel. Gonna, gonna drive me away from from you. Yeah, that, that was that was. I, I spent a whole year on that joke. I hope you enjoyed it. You wanna? Uh, I have a couple of nice stones to give away. Wow! Oh god! Now I have to pick one. <laughs> this is for the Eevee, but I don't. I don't have one. Oh shoot. Um. I can't say no because it won't let me, so I have to pick one. Oh god. Well, I can't think of too many Pokemon that evolve with a Thunderstone besides, like, Pikachu and, uh, you know, Eevee. A Firestone. Screw it. I'm getting a Thunderstone. <laughs> I don't care. If I, if I somehow manage to get an Eevee, that's what I'd use. I'd use a Jolteon. Jolteon and Umbreon are two of my favorite of the EV illusions, so, yeah. I heard Orion from the leader of Sun Touch City is a total weird... Yeah, Orion is, um... No. <laughs> I'm supposed to find this girl named Nora, this tournament thing. You think you can give me a hand? I have no clue who she is. Oh, you won't let me leave. Okay, so apparently I'm supposed to find this Nora in order to leave. So there is an event to be triggered here. I like how I'm saying it, like, uh, th uh, no plot regression or anything like that. I'm going to participate in the next school t trainer school tournament. I've been practicing for days. Yeah, sure you have. Oh, this is the trainer school. Is there anything back here? They this looks like they tried to do something here. Yes, 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 of course there is. Of course there is the super potion for my enjoyment variety. Mm, yes. I don't know who puts it. Who puts a potion out in the middle of nowhere? Oh, Jesus, camera. Where is that girl? Has she run off again? I don't care how good a trainer she is. She knows she's supposed to be here. Oh, can we start without her? Voice changes like every two seconds. It's like a problem. Got an Eevee for a start for Pokemon. I wonder it, what it'll evolve into. <laughs> uh, nothing. Maybe. Cool kids have swag, don't you know? Don't you know? Cool kids have this all the swag, yeah. Might be a fair bit older than all the other kids here, but don't you think you can ever be too old to learn? More importantly, you can't be too old for Pokemon. I know who wrote <laughs> Some old guy wrote that. Oh, hey, Snag. Oh, hey, Snag. I've been here at the trainer school learning how to become a better trainer. You know, you should, too. No reason why not. <coughs> oh, hello there. Welcome to Minnetown. Trainer school. I'm a teacher here. I quit being a trainer while I guess I used to go out to take the generation train. It took us as hell. I'm happy to teach you about type of like this. Yeah, learn the both. <laughs> you can't beat your cutmates! Get some points! Okay. So what she's telling me about right now is a tournament? It'll be a good way to learn more about you and how the best how to teach you. Mm. I wasn't paying attention to any of that because I was too busy making fun of you. And friggin' can I skip this? Teach you type effect miss. Yeah, I'm here to learn. Planning on having a tournament between students here to see how much we all learn. However, one of our star students, Nora, seems to have gone missing. We can't start a tournament without here, so I'm afraid you have to wait. Okay, so we do have to find Nora. So the whole point of this is to find a Nora. Hmm. Uh, I'm trying to think of a joke with that. All I could think of at the moment was Pandora, but that doesn't work because it's Nora. Well, Nora am I. That's all I can figure, but I, I but there's not, like no beginning part to the joke. It's just Nora, and then it just falls flat in your face. Are you Nora? 
<laughs> no, you're a dude. Ha! Ah, I'm kidding. I don't think this guy's required, so skip him a giga goo goo. Uh, who gained a level? I think, um, our Cubone gained two levels from that battle, so. Good! Said Pine was pining. So he got what he, he wanted in the end. Oh, it's a fan bee! I'm not gonna yell. Because <laughs> I'm not like that, man. I'm not like that. I could be, but I just choose not to. Got away safely. Thank goodness. I can't afford to lose you. you. I've already lost you too many times. Once. You know, that that was that was a traumatic experience. I will never soon forget. I will never soon forget, yes. Uh, English is my first language. It actually is. That's the sad part about all this. Uh, what's this? Nose pass! Ah, uh, yes, the Moe statue from the Easter Islands. I mean, uh, it's an original Pokemon. What am I... No, no. No. That's... that's... Mm. <laughs> so. Uh, looking up here, there was an escape rope, so I definitely want to get that. Probably shouldn't have healed Cubone, because we only just started in this freaking cave. <laughs> okay, so... Okay, so before we begin going through that cave, we're going to stock up on supplies. Because I'd rather not be, you know, laying dead in the cave trying to find one person. It's probably in the cave, I'm, I'm just assuming, because the way they laid it out, it's like, Oh, where is Nora gone? Has she gone in the mysterious place that not too many people go into that's off to the side? No, I don't know where she went. So yeah, she's probably in that freaking game. <laughs> and we're gonna get some repels. Uh, we'll get about... Oh, I already have two, so I, I'll just get five again. Uh, no, we're gonna get some potions. Definitely need those. Uh, get seven should do it. Poke bales. Eh, four. Eh, that should do it. I think I really need anything else. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Or sir. I'm going to assume that's a dude, but if it's not a dude, then I'm going to look extremely stupid. Extremely stupid. I don't know, there's a lot of there's a people out there that look like the other people. Especially when they put on makeup. I don't know. I don't know where I was going with that. Anyway. Alright. Uh, went the wrong way. That's, that's, that's a good start. That's a good start. Dude, it's a shuckle! Oh, it's a snake turban. I, I don't know, is that the inspiration behind it? What is the inspiration behind a shuckle? Is it supposed to be like a worm coming out of a rock or something? I don't know. Oh! No. God dang it. Gosh darn. You know, I ask these, like, rant rhetorical questions, and... I don't know, I never actually mean for an answer. They just, like... I don't know. I ask weird questions. They're not really rhetorical, though. They're just kind of like, oh, here on the spur of the moment. Oh, what is that? Huh? I, I don't know. Just trying to keep her going. But anyway, we have a hiker. I'm assuming when he got here, he was taking a hike. I keep moving my camera, trying to get it centered on me, but it's it's no use. It's no use. I mean, Fix that for a bit. So I try to do this. I'm not sure if I can hit that soul rock. It might have levitate. So I'm gonna switch out to the absolutely broken Dryzor. Dryzor. It's that it sounds like that uh, freaking mantis from Space Ghost. I think that's what it is. I I don't know. Break mantis. No, I sound like the um, the uh, blood dragon announce guy. Far Cry Three Blood Dragon. I love that voice for some reason. I, I don't know why. Just like the quintessential like that is an interesting voice that I've never heard of before. So I was like, huh. I want to keep doing that. Far Cry Three Blood Dragon. Sat by Blood Headbutt. Can you defeat the Lunatone? <coughs> Can't do it too long, apparently. Can't do it too long for some reason. Even though it's an easy voice to do, we cannot do it. Hooray! So, we got a Lunatone and a Soul Rock. Uh, I'm assuming that's some kind of sign about an, uh, an apocalypse of some sort. Are you, uh, 
A telepathy? A telepathy. Not a, not telepathy. A telepathy. You, you gonna give me a call? And tell me how you doing, baby cakes? Cause I, like, I wanna know. I wanna keep up with you and all that. that's gonna and just go dead. I don't know where I'm going with that. That town looks pretty. And we're gonna end the thought there. <laughs> that town looks pretty. Just dead. You can find cool items in there too. Wow! I didn't read the first part. I think most fighting type moves and other moves like Woodhammer are able to break the rocks. Huh. So instead of just rock smash, we could break rocks with any fighting type move? That's good. I like that. That is much better. Then the freaking oh you have to have this move that is specifically designed to break rocks like really I can't just have a fighting type on me like come on it's it's more convenient but it, it's it's enough of a um like you you need this to progress on but it's not so much as to sound like it's getting in the way where you have to go all the way back it's like you probably have a fighting type on you or something so that is a lot better. <gasps> It's real, Oh, now I have to hurt it. No, I can't look. Oh, no, why would you make me do that? No, I love real <laughs> God damn it. Sad pun, why? <laughs> that made me so sad. You find cool lines in there, too. They Wait, didn't the other guy say that, too? Do they all say that? Like, as soon as I beat her, she's gonna be like, Oh, you can find cool items in there, too. A school opened up for kids in town just like you. Shouldn't you be standing around this? Well, I was before you, like, uh, walked over to me and, like, Hmm, shouldn't you be studying? I'll teach you. Gadget. Dude, it's a Flabebe. That's cool. That's a weird... I never was a fan of Flabebe. Or, well... It's a, it's a weird-looking Pokemon. I don't, I don't know. Dude, that's a crit! It's with me and saying, dude. It's like, dude! Nice. Don't kill me. Thank you. <laughs> wow, it actually listened. Um, gonna keep Sad Pin out. Ooh, level 13. Trying to learn Leer. I can't imagine much of a use for Leer besides, uh. Will Leer and Tail Whip do the same thing? <laughs> What's the point? <laughs> what? There is no point in learning both those moves! They do the exact <laughs> They do the exact same thing! What? Oh, we got the Swirlix. Oh, I do like sw Swirlix, though. It's it's pretty cute. It's got a little thing going on with it. It's pretty cute, though. It's like a little... I wanted to say dog when I first saw it, but now it looks not like that. I don't know. Okay, so we're in a bit of a predicament here. I'm gonna... Oh, dude, what, what are you doing, man? Use, use the super potion, my friend. Use it. You got to, got to use it. You can't be all abusing it. I've got a confuse ray. That way I can actually hit you. <laughs> Apparently fairy is good against... Uh, no, I'm a part dragon type. That's right. I have to remember that. I keep forgetting that. No, not confuse... Ah, ah, I know I'm confused already. It's not what I plan to do. Okay, good. Gonna kill the little. What is that? A little. It's, it's like a chinchilla mixed with like a pomeranian, or something. It's got a little kangaroo in there to be standing up on two legs. I don't know. Can it hop around? Does it spin? Is 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 is. I don't know. One more uh, shadow sneak should finish it off though. So. Oop, you're dead. I popped the Swirlix. I popped it. I popped it. I don't know what that's supposed to be. Your kid's battle skills. Oh, you didn't say, uh, you could find it there too. Good. <laughs> Good, man. There's some, there's some variety. You didn't, you didn't go with all the, the sames. You weren't all the, like all the other people. All them boys and girls trying to fit in. Nah, nah, nah. You, your own independent woman. 12.5% health. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay. There's there's apparently 12.5% health in this game. That's something I did not know. Uh, let's see. I can run away from that. Probably now. I'm level 14 now. Yeah. Yeah, what, what? Dude, check this guy out. 
I know that's like the uh, uh, Meg Mortar guy who does like a flamethrower thing, but come on! What the hell? <laughs> what the heck? It's, it looks really awkward there. He's just like, oh, life. <laughs> Can't believe I have to stand around this freaking cave. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so this girl down this tree, what did I tell you guys? Obviously, there's this independent section we obviously have to go down in. Hey, life? Who knows? Anyway, we got a headbutt. Uh, I guess I'll use it. It should be good. I think, um, Flabebe and its evolutions are more specifically d designated to special defense, so headbutt being a physical move should be good. Um, I'm not too sure about the Bone Club. I'm not sure if it's physical or not. Level 15! My goodness. My goodness, you're just growing like a little weed, aren't you, Seppin? Not that intimidate you. You harlequin! How dare you intimidate a small baby who had his mother died? They looked deeply into each other's eyes as she laid there on the floor. And she just whispered to him, I'm proud of you, son. Don't go in this world. You bitch! B bastard. <laughs> you, 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 you. Why am I being correct with an insult? Ugh. Ugh. You, you've twisted me. You've muddled me. You've made me go insane. Well, actually, I wasn't you. I've been insane before that. But, but you assisted with the insanity. Now you must pay for your crimes. There is no forgiveness for the likes of you. There is none. There is none. You swirly, bird-headed... Poop scratch. Yeah, I, yeah, that's right. I called you a poop scratch. What? 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 Bird brain. What? What? That was absolutely. I will never get it. Absolutely. <laughs> All right. He um. <clears throat> he knocks some sense into her. That's a that's a little girl you're talking about. What? All right. The Cubone died. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna go get uh, my Cubone back, and then we're gonna keep progressing on. So, yeah, that's. Yeah, I'll, I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so we're back over here. I'm gonna use a repel and get, we'll pick up this awakening right here. Alright, hopefully we get through the rest of this cave. My goodness, my good. <laughs> Apparently you're not required, because I managed to walk past you, but. I'm gonna have to get this fight, because, uh not required. Sad Pine grew to level 16, and that's a scientist. Okay. Well, because of that fight, I have to heal Sad Pine, because uh, that, was, that was a weird fight. That was, that was a little bit weird at the beginning, but uh, this fight was okay. Not that you guys care. I hope you care. At least enough. Love me. Okay, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Okay. So we're gonna go down here. Da, 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 da. Hopefully, this is where Nora is. Ooh. Ah, uh, the decisions. The decisions. Uh, eeny, meeny, miny, we'll go right. Right is never actually right. That's that's the ironic truth about it. Pell's effect, we're off at. Nah, I think we're like right there. At least we should be. Yeah, there she is. There she is. Celebi? All right, Celebi. Nah, I'm not gonna do the voice. All right, Celebi. The fossils are in place. We've been waiting for ages. I'm sure you can get it right this time. Come on out. All right, Celebi. I believe in you. Bring these fossils into the modern age. Use Tesseract. Excuse me. Oh, Celebi, you did a great job. I'm pro. Whoa. All these incredible fossils from a long time ago. Armaldo Bastion. Bastiodon, Kabudobs, and Amistar, and great job, Silby. You can turn them back now. I can't believe how far we've... Who are you? What do you want? How much did you see? Uh, look, it doesn't matter how much you saw. Nobody can know that Silby chose me. Excuse me. How, how can you prove to me you won't tell anyone? Well, I mean, I'm a mute. What was that? Uh-oh. <laughs> you go away! Is that Mew? Could it be? You were chosen by Mew- Say what? That's incredible. Wait, what? I was cho I thought I was- Okay, I wasn't chosen by nobody. I am chosen by nobody. I found this thing. It follows me. It talked to me in my dream. I was just like- 
Okay, okay, Obama. I'll I'll do whatever you say. Not Obama. This is Martin Luther King. <laughs> oh, we're doing good today. We're we're on a roll. We're doing great. Just keeping it rolling. But you were chosen by one of the pixies. That means pixies. Really? That's what we're gonna call them. That means that it might not have to be me. I should probably explain. You see, not too many people know about it, but a long time ago there was prophecy about the cults. I don't know it myself, but my parents told it to me a long time ago. It said that a trainer would chosen by one of the legendary Pokemon would be the one to find and defeat all the cults. It would also said that the legendary Pokemon would be one of the rare pixie legendaries. You know, like Mew, Celebi, Jirachi, Vicatini, and so on. When the cults heard about this, they were instructed to kill anyone who was chosen by one of those Pokemon. Um, I go on. People were terrified. If the cults killed the hero who was supposed to fulfill the prophecy, we would never be saved. But the first Argor came and fought against the cults. He defeated tons of them. But as I'm sure you heard, he disappeared a year ago. People think he was the hero of the prophecy because he was friends with Hoopa, one of the Pixie legendary Pokemon. You know, the one that we're not supposed to know about, Game Freak, but we know because people are bitches about it. It's true. We aren't supposed to know about that thing yet. He's gone now. Nobody knows where he is. The second Agor has taken his place, and he hasn't been chosen by any of the Pixies, as far as I'm aware. That's why I have to hide the fact that Celebi chose me. I'm afraid the cults will come after and attack me. I have to train down here, in secret. I mean, I don't think I'm the hero of the prophecy, but just in case. But now I see Mew has chosen you, the prophecy could be about either of us. You have to understand, you can't let anyone know that Mew has chosen you. Mew hasn't joined your team yet, has it? That's probably why it's concerned that if it does, it, you might become a target. So be careful from now on. We're too valuable to risk. Oh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, okay. I'd better get it going. Up in Midtown, there's a trainer school I learned from. None of us other students are any challenge for me, but occasionally they hold tournaments I join. There's a one about to start soon, so I need to get going. Why don't you enter too? It's about a good way to train and learn more about being a trainer. And you and I are... We need all the training we can get. See up there. Okay, so I was expected to have the um, the uh, escape rope. I'm, I'm assuming. I'm assuming that's uh, that's why she didn't teleport me out of here. She assumed I would have the escape rope. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Oh, look, there's a st statue of Cresselia. What? It's just sitting there. Just like, uh, hi, I guess I'm, I guess I'm here. <laughs> Hello there, little pilgrim. <laughs> I guess I'll just cut back out of the cave, because they didn't do anything. <coughs> okay, I'm out of the cave. Thank God. I didn't want to be in there. I don't like dark, dank places. Also, that statue, please, for the love of... No, I didn't want to use it. <laughs> I didn't want to use that. Okay. Let me just heal my Pokemon. So apparently we are chosen people chosen by pixies in order to, to do that. The only pixie Pokemon I thought was like Mess Spirit, Azelf, and uh, Uxie. I thought those were the only like pixies. But apparently like there are, they aren't or something. I don't, I don't know. Dude, it's a Floatzel! Oh, it's a Floatzel! Is it awful? It's holding a left foot. Wait, you just get leftovers by what? <laughs> hey kid, I just my also my god. Holy shit. Dude, what have you been feeding your kid? Holy crap! My god, look at this NPC! Jesus! Kids, hold still. Kid? Kid kid, please, please. Kid? Kid I swear. No. I swear, I swear to God, I'm gonna, I'm gonna catch him and I'm gonna talk to him. I don't know how. I don't know why you ugly shirt knock. <laughs> what? You know, if you want to get involved, community. I heard someone at the broadcast. <laughs> Did he just call me an ugly shirt noggler? Fancy beret. Yeah, I can, I can buy stuff, but I'm choosing not to. Cause Zatu. Thank you. Thank you.
Thank you. You're, you're, you're too kind. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So in the next episode of Pokemon Insurgents, we're going to participate in that trainer tournament that they talked about. So if you like this episode, please hit the little buttons at the bottom. They make me happy. They make me feel good inside. And they show that uh, you liked what I made. And, you know, it, it inspires me to keep making. It's like, I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Have a good day, and I'll see you later. Take it easy. I, I, I don't know what this is. This is like, this is like my mind to yours. We are telepathy. Telepathy. Ooh, bringing it around.